The Loose Women star told her 21,000 Instagram followers, it's never too late to change, as she confidently posed in a dark green, showing off the results from her Life's the Life diet. Flaunting her curves, she left very little to the imagination in the two-piece swimwear which struggled to contain her assets. The 60-year-old actress looked happier than ever, as she beamed a smile for the camera, holding out her arms in the air. Denise captioned the upload, It's never too late to turn your life around. At Lighter Life. Penned, such an inspirational lady, well done at Denise underscore Welch, you've done amazing, looking good girl, a third added. According to The Sun, Denise also uploaded a video to her fans jiggling her hips as she celebrated the anniversary of her massive hit, she reportedly informed her followers that it had been 23 years since she released a recording of Dusty Springfield's You Don't Have to Say You Love Me. The single reached number 23 in the charts. In the clip, she played the song in the background and told the camera, 23 years since I had a massive massive hit with this song. You're welcome. Last week, Denise returned to the Loose Women panel after five years to talk about her former battle with alcoholism and being sober for six years. She told the panelists, It is five years in October since I left Loose Women, and six years since I got sober. Denise candidly spoke out about her experiences with alcohol, where she revealed she had blackouts. The former Coronation Street star went to say she was proud of her and her husband Lincoln Townley, 45, for giving up the drink. She said, I am a different person now. I have guilt and shame, I have to deal with it with myself. I'm still fun now. During her appearance on the show, viewers were left puzzled by her new accent. One user commented, at Real Denise Welch, how come your accent has changed so much? You sound proper posh. Now, where the F asterisk asterisk K has Denise Welch's Geordie accent gone? A second asked. A third added, why has Denise Welch lost her accent?